Hi, we're Courage My Love, and you're watching Logan Reed TV. Okay, I'm Mercedes. I'm the lead singer of Courage My Love. I'm Brandon. I play bass. I'm Phoenix. I play drums. Uh, we've done headliner tours before, but not as big as this one, so we're really excited to do this one. Uh, yeah, it's our first time with a new CD. It literally comes out the first day of the tour is today, and it literally comes out like on Tuesday, so we're really excited to tour across Canada, and yeah, we just can't wait. Uh, it's definitely a lot different. Um, the music is a lot different. Uh, the songs are, I think they've grown a lot. They're a lot more mature. But yeah, we all have, like, we can all say something about it. Like. I feel that new CD is a lot more mature than the one I wasn't in. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, like, I don't know, it's great, I love it. I Everything they said, pretty much, it's just like a whole different animal. I play bass. <laughs> I don't know. I, I do my thing and I try to do it as well as I can. And just uh, improve the band, I guess. <laughs> He's being modest. He actually is like really killer at bass and like just his style of playing is a lot different. So it really influenced a lot of the songs on the EP. And you, can, you can totally hear a difference in the playing. Worst tour experience so far? Uh, I, we haven't had a lot of bad experiences, honestly. Like, I love every single tour we've been on. One time, though, we were playing in this community center a long time ago, and it was for a lot of little kids. And as soon as we started playing, they just like screamed and covered their ears and were like running all over the place because it was like their first ever concert. So I think that was kind of weird. But at one time, we played for like some Boy Scouts. And that was kind of weird too, but yeah, those are, I mean, it wasn't really bad, it was just strange. <laughs> yeah. <All right. laughs> uh, we try our best, that's yeah. for sure, but um, we had a rehearsal like the other week with our record label, our record label team, and they, um, they try to help us put it together as best as they could as well, but like a after we took uh, their advice and uh, we just went back to the jam hall, reworked that again, and then we got our we got what we think is a good set, so <laughs> we'll just rock that. It's out. so hard to choose between old songs and new songs because we love all of them. I love the old songs, but I love the new songs so much too, so I don't know. It was tough. That was amazing. It was his first music video with us, so that was it was really exciting. Uh, I think it's one of my favorite music videos we've ever done. Uh, we got tied up and we were like tied up in ropes and stuff for it, so that was the first time we've ever done anything like that. I don't know. As far as you know. Yeah, as, as far as everyone knows. But yeah, it was crazy. I loved it. Yeah, it happens. But it's, I mean, we got we got someone to protect us, so it's all good. I mean, usually you just have to try and not put out any of the wrong signals, and, and uh, if someone does get the wrong idea, just try and shut it down as soon as you can, otherwise you have crisis. I'm the big brother, watch your back. <laughs> Well, I mean, I definitely think that the new EP is a lot different from any regular pop punk you're going to hear. It, you know, it's not as, I don't want to say stereotypical, but like stereotypical, you know what I mean? Um, we put a lot of different genres into our music. I can't even really decide what genre we are anymore. We're just Courage My Love, so I feel like that helps a lot. And we're all equally creative in the band and we all are really 
I don't know, just passionate about what we do. So I don't know if that makes us different, but this is who we are. Oh, uh, it's been pretty good. Like, we were lucky enough to stream it on Much Music a couple days before we released it. And uh, the fan reaction is actually pretty good. I was a little bit nervous just because it, it, it is a lot different than the last EP. But uh, so far, people seem to like it. and. Honestly, I, I think we all like it better too, so we're just we're just on a cloud nine. <laughs> well, okay, switching roles with Phoenix wouldn't be that different because we're twins, so I guess I'd have to switch roles with Brandon just to see what it's like. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Like, I don't know, it might be cool to be a guy for a day, I don't know. If I got to switch roles with Brandon, I would just get way more tattoos, like, all over. Cover his, <laughs> the whole face. <laughs> Definitely. In the future, we want to do a full length, that's been our dream. And I think that's the next thing that's going to happen is a full length. After this EP has, like, run its course, we definitely want to do a full length. We had enough songs to release a full length for this one, but we thought that we were going to wait and really make our full length as crazy and awesome as it possibly could be. Uh, we're still writing and stuff, you know, we want to try and write every day to get new ideas, so yeah, hopefully soon. It's fake, it's like, we're, we're just joking around, you know, like, the three of us, on tour, you get addicted to like really bad TV because by the time you get back to the hotel, that's all it's playing is like really bad reality shows. So we got inspired by like Jersey Shore and stuff like that. <laughs> We're joking around like 80% of the time. Yeah. I guess for me, I mean, we can all say something, but like for me, I'd just say please check out our website, check out our Facebook, uh, and you'll find all the dates of the Becoming Tour. So yeah, if you don't mind doing that, that'd be sweet. You can buy our album on iTunes or order it online. So yeah, and thank you so much for being our fans. We love you so much. You make it happen. We love you. <laughs> uh, check out our new CD. Woo! <laughs> We're, We're Courage, my love. love. Thanks for watching.